one. But yeah, I'm totally telling you, dude. Like, seriously, Thanos is going to show up with Chewbacca's severed head, and Stan is going to pop up and save everyone from the from the evil Kylo Ren. I tell you, that's how episode 9 spot's going to go. Oh shit, we're live again. See you guys. Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Okage Shadow King. You know, Boba Fett is secretly an <laughs> Avenger. You Boba Fett. <laughs> and then Soul Bad Guy is going to pop out of nowhere. And get into Smash Brothers. And then Mega Man's gonna pop out. I'm telling you, we're getting Dante in Smash. Wasn't this a oh, this is good. Yeah. I'm derailing it. Can't derail it if it wasn't on the rails in the first place. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh. Ugh. It's just filled with white energy. It's so easy to make a joke, but I'm not going to. Cause Simon. <laughs> there, it's done. <laughs> no need. Jesus, fuck! You killed it. See what I mean? <laughs> I mean, they don't generally have like around, I think, like what, 300 hit points anyway. Jesus. So like, and then we got money too. Oh, Blizzard shorts. I got a weakness for them now. Hey, you learned fucking Vegeta. <laughs> Secret Sword! Captain Sword! Thank you. Give me any Dragon Ball character's abilities, which would it be? Fuck! <laughs> I'm, aware, I'm aware of that dragon. <laughs> You never heard of fuck. Son fuck. Yeah, yeah. that's a great saying for you. <laughs> you never heard of fuck from the, from the adventure of fuck. You never heard of fuck from Dragon Ball GT, man. <laughs> from Dragon Ball AF. <laughs> it's Dragon Ball AF. Get the lore right. Dragon Ball F. Fuck. No, you never heard of Urban Legend. You know what? I heard of it in Super Saiyan. Five. <laughs> Dude, it was just like, like <laughs> abomination, <laughs> furry and shit. Man. Dragon Ball A. It's, yeah. <laughs> it's just like a it's Dragon Ball GT. Yeah, that one. I recognize that. Yeah, shit. Dragon Ball AF, Dragon Ball Wiki. <laughs> Fucking Dragon Ball. This article is about the. <laughs> you, Dragon Ball AF is a long running man. <laughs> you read it. So I need a guy to kind of focus on the battle. Dragon Ball 5. <laughs> and then, like, we have fucking Dragon Ball Super now, anyway, which has, like, fucking Ultra Instinct. I wish we had Super Saiyan 4 again. <laughs> oh, wait, hang on. Evil Goku. DeviantArt. 2009. <laughs> have you ever. This was, like, uploaded in 2009? <laughs> it looks like Goku Black! 2009. Yeah, like, holy f I found out about this from, like, esoteric internet. Damn, son. <laughs> like, this is the power of I can't believe Toriyama stole from DeviantArt. Are you Dude, he is a so unique and original. Yes, Super Saiyan Rose sounds right. Black Goku, Goku Black. I can't, I can't believe, believe Toriyama ripped this guy up. What the fuck? I hate Dragon Ball now. I think this guy is secretly Black. <laughs> Prophet. Black before black. This guy can see the fucking future. Hard ass reads. Goku Black. Pinto gratis! Excuse me? This is nothing, everyone. Look at the name of this. <laughs> it's so funny, like, oh, I'm gonna post, I'm gonna fucking post the, post the fucking link to this as well. Fucking evil Goku. Oh, okay, yeah, we're having a front over in 30 minutes. That shouldn't be too bad. Fucking evil Goku. I'm, I'm actually gonna post a link to uh, the esoteric in internet video, actually, because it also talks about other interesting things. Still like, haven't answered the question, by the way. I told you, fuck! <laughs> the Super Saiyan Warrior, fuck! <laughs> He's the legendary Super Saiyan! <laughs> He's the Super Duper Legendary Saiyan! Fuck Bardock, he was the first Super Saiyan. <laughs> Bardock was never the first Super Saiyan, though. In non-canon, he was. 
done fanfic sitting watching me. No one in the Bardock. Your hospital is fanfiction. <laughs> it's non canon. That's why it's fanfiction. Not everything that's non canon is fanfiction. It is fucking fanfiction. I refuse to acknowledge that. It was officially made. <laughs> To be its official fan fiction. What the fuck is official fan fiction? I'll tell you what official fan fiction is. You wanna know what official fan fiction is? What? It's not with the Phantom Menace. No, that's still acknowledged. <laughs> you can't say that. Yeah, you're right. Official fan fiction is the Force Unleashed. <laughs> that's fan fiction now. Nah, I can come up with better. What? Is that fanfiction enough for your no. main character to be the secret Vader apprentice? No. Goes around killing I got a better one. Uh, no, I got a better one. What's official fanfiction? One more day! That was made just to sell it. Joker say that he's like, I don't like Spider Man with Mary Jane. I'm gonna have them sell their marriage to the fucking devil. I don't like character development. <laughs> yeah, well, that's like, you. Agent Marvel themselves barely wants to admit that story fucking exists. Oh well, yeah. I'd rather have the fucking spider semen thing than fucking one more day. Like, the spider semen thing's at least funny for the wrong reasons. One more day is just, like, so horrible. Like... Spider semen. At least, like, the spider semen is funny. Radio it's stupid, but it's, it's funny. Radioactive Dude, spider semen. Radioactive spider semen. Are you trying to do it? No, no, no. Yeah, the fucking 1990s. Yeah, the fucking 1990s. Radioactive spider semen. Radioactive spider semen. Yeah, let's check out a fucking proper DVD release, dude. I wish Protector Spider Man finished, but it didn't. Well, that that was something that couldn't have been helped, actually. We're gonna get Carnage, man. Like, I agree, that was a great show! But it's like, the problem with that was just more like, that was just due to bad timing than anything. So like, Sony wanted the movie rights, but they had to give up the TV rights to Disney as a result. But Disney could have just went, yeah, we'll continue this. Yeah, but they didn't own the rights to a spectacular, though. Oh. Sony owns the rights to that. Can Sony just give them them? That would take a lot of legal... Crap. You want to forget but. Yeah, like, we're not fucking copyright experts here, okay? Like, we're fucking playing- we're what fucking playing talking? someone else's game and talking over it. What are you talking about? This is legal. <laughs> Jesus. Fucking move terrifies me every time, cause it's just boom, 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 boom. boom. Oh fuck, this thing needs to get nutted. Nut! You- Nut, you sexy, sexy man. I wouldn't call him that. He's sexy, what are you talking about? He has a fucking... He fucking looks like... A silver fox. Mm. He's like Joseph Joestar, a silver fox. Mm. <laughs> he is just as hot as old Joseph. You're on recording saying this shit, by the way. <laughs> I know. <laughs> so I hope you're okay with that. <laughs> I am! You know Joseph Joestar, that famous DMC character? <laughs> yeah, Joseph, he's the son of Sparta. <laughs> fucking fights virtual, it's like, oh my god! <laughs> you can judge a fish No, that would be the fucking. That'd be, no, that'd be fan of blood. <laughs> like, Jonathan, Vir Jonathan Dio would literally like just do goddamn Virgil on that boy. And Nero's fucking Jotaro or some shit. No, Nero would be Giorno. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> Why does that fit so well? Cause jo Seriously, Don't Wait Die references JoJo a fair amount, too. Well, I mean, all I can think of is the Nightmare enemy. Hey, Kyrie, Kyrie was a stone- the enemies that pulled out the fucking stone masks. Yeah, Nightmares. Those are Nightmares? I think so. That's what- Cause I think- The Nightmare I always think of those- That one fucker I always have to chase with items. There we go. Could look it up, but. <laughs> <laughs> Aha! Yes. I just had to look around. <laughs> do, 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 do. That's you at the last floor here. It's a lot more straightforward. Yeah. Then I like the music here a little bit better, too. Like, again, it's. I think that's one of those reminiscent of games like that Neverhood and Skull Monkeys, though. I see a crash 
that's what it reminded me of. I mean, I can kind of see that, but I feel more like an everyone. But to be fair, I don't think I've ever shown you that before, or the soundtrack at least. Nope. Well, the soundtrack of Neverhood is very ear of it and silly. Speaking of, I think I should re I, I should revisit Skull Monkeys at some point in the channel because I think that's like actually one that Let's Play of mine I'm not really the most satisfied with. Why is it there? Forget it. <laughs> and this is about the Neverhood EA owns the rights, and they're not bothering to talk with the Netball about it. No, let's just talk about RPG things. Like, why is there a crash RPG? <laughs> I guarantee someone probably would have tried that, and it would have probably ended up like Crash of the Titans. I guarantee you. Actually, no, not Crash of the Titans. Most likely, might have been Mutant. Titans, at least from what I've seen, is fundamentally okay on a gameplay level. It's boring real quick. Yeah, but it's not Light Over Mutant, which is even worse. I was just thinking, it's like, out of all the ideas Crash has done, why not that? That and also, I don't like Crash have enough to really carry an RPG. Why isn't there another Sonic RPG? Well, there's an answer for that. Dark Chronicles sucked ass. Yeah, but try it again. <laughs> that they don't, Sega doesn't want to risk the wrath of Ken Fenders. Then don't use the kid, yes, who gives a fuck? <laughs> Ken Fenders would like to remind you all that Sally was supposed to fuck a 27 year old. And she was 16. <laughs> yes, Ken Fenders actually said that, as if he couldn't get any fucking lower. Sonic was about to get cocked by a pedophile. <laughs> <laughs> all because Ken. I don't even think Ken Fenders seriously was planning it. I think what he was. I think he's just trying to get controversy at this point. Because he's a washed up comic book artist. Could you make that? for this episode. What? Sonic was supposed to get cocked <laughs> by a pedophile. <laughs> Sonic was supposed to get cock blocked by a pedophile, yes. Yes, that'll be the title of this episode. I'll write that down. <laughs> Fucking Sonic gets cocked by a pedophile. <laughs> it's like a... That's <laughs> word title right there. It's, it's like... Is Ken Better a fucking member of Nambla at this point? Nambla? This is an actual organization for... It stands for North American Man Boy Love Association. Oh god. You wanna know what I found out about this South Park? Which had that as a satire. I thought And I just thought it was a joke, but then my dad told me the thing was an actual real organization. Are you fucking for real? Yes! It exists! I hope oh, fuck. No. Parkman joins Nambla. Which, this was a season 4 episode, too. Well, that's a while ago, isn't it? Yeah. See? This is real! This is fucking real! I hate life. <laughs> this is fucking real! This... Why? Just why? Why is that allowed to continue to exist? It doesn't! They actually don't hold any more official meetings as a result. But... It held official meetings at one point? Yeah, they had actual- The podcast shit exists! It exists? He does so utterly- Oh, he keeps things not couch spread, by the way. He just puts a book over his head and just takes a nap. Makes sense. He just gets up. But it's just- But yeah, it like, exists. Dude, like, honestly, like, what the fuck? Officially, it existed at one point. That's See? It. You wonder the- It's- it, like, it's like a small organization. I just thought, okay, that's a funny joke they invented. And then I'm like, wait, this is a real thing? Someone actually made this organization and went, yep, nothing's wrong with this. <laughs> Nothing at all. I mean, it's like so wrong on, like, fundamentally every level. Every level this is, like, so fundamentally wrong. Can't believe how wrong this is. It's like, uh... This is wrong on so many levels. <laughs> Let's just see what we can find out of it. Like, it's just the whole thing is just see, again, it's so wrong. <laughs> Ken Fenders, <laughs> like we're making a call post on our Twitter.com. Ken Fenders, you have a small dick. It's the size of a small nut, except way smaller. And your small dick is why you go after children because of that dick. <laughs> Ken, Ken Penders wanted to fucking cock Sonic, and then he said his dick was this big. And Sonic said that was disgusting. disgusting. So we're making a call post on our fucking YouTube.com. 
fucking fair. I'm like so derailed now all because of that. Now we brought up fucking Nambla. I just wanted to ask what Dragon Ball character <laughs> and now we're on we're we're fucking Nambla. Hang on, I'm gonna fucking turn the AC on. <laughs> what Dragon Ball character do you want to be? Have you heard about Sonic getting cucked by a 20 year old? <laughs> It's just, it's so funny how we just get to this... I don't even know how the fuck we got to this topic at all. Oh, we gotta go to a fight. <laughs> and look, it's Dan Benders! He's that fucking wolfling. Oh, man. Those crabs don't look like their texture finishes them. Hmm? I'm gonna run those wolf guys are actually a pain in the ass to fight. No. <laughs> run away from Dan Benders! Before he also copyrights us! Run away before he. <laughs> How the fuck did that guy copyright all of the kidnaps? Don't ask me how the. Don't ask me how the legal system works! That just seems weird. Shouldn't it be. Like I mean, how do you own characters like Sally? Is the thing. But couldn't they just ask like. He's got a fucking copyright knuckles! Are you? What kind of dumb bitch is he is? He's a small name, all ego. He's like Chris Chan. Like, fucking get like, uh, fuck Has it. Chris Chan tried to copyright Sonic? He tried, yeah. <gasps> Speaking of, Chris. Oh god. <laughs> Copy. Chris did copyright on the fucking quickie. Do you want to see what he has? Look, look at this shit right here. What? <laughs> he did it. He copyrighted Sonic 2. Yes, he has Sonic 2 officially got. He spent forty dollars and got Sonic 2 submitted for fucking copyrights. <laughs> I'm sure this is the fucking Randy. This was an interesting discussion. Let's never discuss this again. No, we are continuing this. I'm sending this shit to Randy. Oh my god. Because Randy. <laughs> Randy goes with my quote-unquote obsession. You need to be cursed with this knowledge as well. I can't be the only one. <laughs> but yeah, like I said, I'm gonna pull up an image of Chris Chan from 2007. And, uh, fucking Karen Banders. <laughs> like, uh, holy fuck. I wish I could show you guys the pictures of these. Like, look at these two! Look! And he's got a fucking Porta mustache, too! Oh, yeah. Like, he looks like a fucking... He looks like one of those guys you see in, like, fucking porn movies. And look at Chris Chan! Like, look! Look at these two! You know, the only difference that... The only difference that he actually... No! There, there is no difference! Chris at least... Chris Chan! At least... Has an interesting life to read about for the most part! This guy is just... Dan Penders is just some guy that's only known for just simply being an idiot. Chris Chan is just a whole nother level. Have you ever seen Chris Chan and Ken Penders in the same room? No. Nah. <laughs> Guess what? Fucking Ken Penders. Like, I'm going on his fucking Twitter real quick. Ken Penders. I'm going to make a call out post on my Twitter. Twitter. I'm seeing what his fucking Twitter has done recently, though. Because I, he's got to be, this is going to be fucking interesting. People are gonna- oh, he's giving- he's giving a side of the fucking legal battle now! Oh my god. Oh boy, now he's just simply trying to- he's starting to really deflect the blame now, he's just simply really trying. What kind of fucking shit is that? Each day under Trump, I feel like we're devolving into Germany, 1930. What the fuck? I mean, let's not dwell on that, because we are not a channel that has made us discuss politics. That's a fucking egregious claim there. <laughs> yeah, like, we're not that extreme yet. We haven't That's reached that level yet. We haven't reached the fucking Ken level. Penders just won the fucking top. Like, you can tell he's just doing this explicitly to damage control now. Like, we haven't even reached the level below that one yet. That's amazing. Let's see. Let's see, I'm gonna use my uh, fucking escape rope just to go quickly save. Oh, power candy. I think that's a key slime. Oh, shit. 
Let's get the escape rope and we're gonna heal up real quick before this fight, because this fight can be pretty tough as well. Hey. No, he got probably get nuts though. Nut. Nut nut. In the butt. <laughs> nut nut in the butt. I said nut nut in the butt. Do you wanna do it in my butt? In my butt? You wanna do it in my butt? In my butt? Let's do it in the butt. Okay. Jesus. Fucking what what in the This is an interest I think I'm glad we chose this game to LP, honestly. Nut. Cause I think we have this is probably the best LP so far. This is outpaced Jack X and fucking Get Devil May Cry 3 already. I don't know about that. <laughs> no, I'm just talking about the LP quality. <laughs> like, there was never a dull moment now, especially. <laughs> like, cause, but yeah, I think I think I've really thought about it now. The more Dragon Ball character. But... Gotta think about this, but I'm thinking. It seems that we are finally here. All set, Jesse. Are you ready in both body and mind? Yes. Now let's be off. But yeah, I think I got it now. What? Goku, it's a transmission. Fuck, I wouldn't be sell. Well, that means you have all the powers, but anyway. Thanks for coming along this way so I can pound you hard, brother! You guys are in good sports! I'll power you into two little tiny pumps, brother! Then I'll stomp on you till you stick to my shoes! Man, I'm excited! Ooh, yeah! Yep, one too many monster energy drinks. Um, excuse me for interrupting your excitement, but I have a question for you, big bull lately. Have you been here at the back of this tunnel all along without trying to conquer the world? Yep! I don't care about world conquest, brother! I just want to fight strong opponents! Me grinding fights, that's my life! Ooh, yeah! Claim the drop! I don't give my world evil king belt to anybody! What the heck is a world evil king belt? I don't know. <laughs> I see! It seems that all sorts of evil kings exist! Now I, the princess, shall specifically be your judge! You may begin. Here we go! I got this for three minutes! Three minutes of playtime! Big Bull is ready! <laughs> just dash it. Big Bull is ready! Come on my face, brother! Not on my face, brother! <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, this is Big Bull Evil King. I believe he has like... This guy has a large amount of fucking hit points. I believe it was like 2,800, which is a... Yeah, he, no, he has, yeah, he has like... Close enough. Yeah, he has like 2,745 hit points, which is a sharp jump from the Chairman Evil King, who you might recall only had 640. Well, so what we need to do is really be careful. Real shit starts now. Let's see, we're gonna overdrive immediately. The frosty does anything to the player frost too? Yeah, it deals neutral damage. Oh, it just does something. Yeah, it only resists if it's something that's explicitly strong against it. Gotcha. It's not like Pokemon. That wasn't very effective. Let's see, key sling. Burden. We're gonna s Yeah, burden. Burn it. Burn on the bur burly bulls. First. Kill them all in a heap. But yeah, I would argue this guy is one of the hardest boss fights in the fucking game. You remember that? Yeah, you, want, you remember that one seal attack that ha locks me out of my items? Mm -hmm. These guys have those a lot. And they stack. Which means they can lock you out of your items too. Yeah. Until the fight ends. The thing that locks out of your items lock you out of your items too. No, I meant to say you lock you out of your spells. Then your items. Yeah. Charge Parasol. Parasol. Burly Bull. Flame. flame. Yeah, he knows Flame. Ooh, yeah! What? Jump on the top rope, brother! What? Let's get crazy. Let's rock! For the joy. Bum, 
boom. Yep, Keisley got it now. So. Oh, fuck you! No. Yeah, I kinda just need a stack, so I'm gonna give another report to my eye report just before it really can affect him. Jesus Christ. First. Let's rock, baby! Fuck you! You missed. You missed. My, my main brother, by the way, is Billy Bull! Oh, yeah! Call me Billy Bull. Evil King Killer. Call me Billy Bull, the pro wrestler. That's the best name, don't you think? Yes. Now I'm gonna get some wood on it. Boom, so. I would be so. Because I'd be a gross bug that could just insult the people. I'm saying, I'm thinking something more like. Cheering! <laughs> Snell, that's a way cooler name. That was about the name I was thinking. I was thinking something more like Cheering. <laughs> but yeah, notice how the spells are locked out now. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry I have these two, but that's because I take hit points. Suck. Yeah, I'm just gonna use that so I can actually steal some of their life. That way I can steal their magic points out. Suck. Doesn't need too much. Suck. Oh, actually, oh, actually, we restored all our magic points now. It's actually not too bad. Kill. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna wanna use that on Rosalind. Bum, bum, da, da. Let's see. We're gonna wanna heal her. I see Keisling's healed now, so he's good. Let's see, overdrive. Overdrive! I'm actually gonna attack. Because one dies, and Keisling's gonna use Storm on him. Which means all he has to do is just simply probably run up. Let's see, and we're gonna keep off Big Bolt. Hey. Let's see, Keesling, we're gonna have you. We're gonna have you do burden. Let's see, we wanna debuff him now! Powerless is a Lincoln Park song. <laughs> this came out before Lincoln Park. <clears throat> no, this came out at the same time, but I think that probably... I'm gonna look up what that song may be, actually. Song came out recently. Because this game debuted 2001. Like, this game came out before, like, Metal Gear Solid 2 and FF FF10. Like, this game came out March 2000... Yeah, this came out, like, 12 years after. Bum, 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 bum. Meat Factoid. Gonna do that again. We're just gonna keep off the fuck out of him. Let's see, and I think... Man, he looks like he's about to jump. Ready? I'm gonna put him in defense, actually. That was a good idea on my part. Flaming cold. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, you're getting healed fast. Big nut. Yeah, we're gonna use that just now. Oh. That's all we need to do is just survive. Give that to give that to Rosalind. Not all over Rosalind. Yeah, you do your job, and I'm gonna fucking overdrive. Does it make sense to do weakness? I don't. That's why I'm overdriving Keesling. Um, so I can buff his power. But Rosalind and you are the only yeah. Yeah, we have it. I'm just overdriving everyone so I can combine attacks. 
Yeah. That cross doesn't deal too much damage on its own. It's more of a group control. But I do have four. I just wanted to do this so I can put him in weight. And now we combine. Cursing Devil! Oh, he decides to help now. Whip! That's actually not too bad. Thank you, Stan. You did something to me, Stan. I'm proud of you. It's better than when he missed that other time. It's like, I haven't been seeing Stan's power. <laughs> Fucking missed. Oh, fuck. Please. Okay, we should be fine. <laughs> Let's see, and Keysling, you. I'll let Keysling just attack. Lizard sword. Let's see, Rosalind. Each hoof this guy have left. Oh, fuck! He doesn't got a crit, dude! 105. Jesus. How much health? 2,000! Uh, let's see, I need a really... He's fucking doing hundreds of damage. We should get it, be getting him down now. New subscriber. Shout out to my new subscriber, I guess. Blizzard. Uh, gonna nut to him real quick to be safe. And... Like we should be actually get. we should be wearing him down there. I'm gonna have him wait. Good. And we're gonna combine attack there. Stan helps out again! Yay! How about that? Better not fucking miss. <laughs> it's Stan. <laughs> I'm gonna heal Keesling. And Rosalyn. That's Ari. So you gotta really be careful. And I'm gonna go for Blizzard Sword again. Charge. Charge. Oh, is that, that, I think it buffs this attack. So I know what you're gonna do. Debuff your attack. <laughs> get the buffs! Mom, get the buffs! <laughs> They're coming! Let's see, I'm gonna decrease his speed. Oh, he's dead. Never mind! Woo! That was a close one. It's really hard to tell how long you have to do that. I mean, as long as you have a good prepared party, it's not too bad. We need resistance. Let's see what that stuff does. Resistance to the weed. Weed. Learned ice, so now we have a more powerful attack for Rosalind. <laughs> How invigorating it is to gain my dark power back! This is the fourth one! Come on, slave, I'm on a roll! Go defeat the next evil king! We'll pound them to dust! Whoa, did you say you're gonna go pounding things? You're still here? I've already regained my dark power. I don't need you. Go away. Shoot. 
Stop playing cool, besides, you didn't win the victory alone. Indeed, you're strong, brother! That was the toughest battle I ever fought! Ooh, yeah! I felt a brother's soul deep in my heart! Huh? What are you talking about? Who is a brother? Brother, I know my burning fighting spirit! I know you will keep my burning fighting spirit glowing forever! Right, Stan, brother? Ah, me? What? The reason why I waited here is so I can fight with a kindred spirit. A brother? I don't think so. Former big bull evil king, I think you misunderstand. Don't be so stiff, brother! I don't need a title! Just call me big bull! Oh, jeez. Good for you, simple kind evil king. You may take care of him. Silence, you gnat! Just because it is not for you. Before I heard fate calling, it said to me, Hi, want to become the strongest head deep in the sewer? Okay, bye. It was so confusing, but now I get it. It's not me that matter, it's you, brother! Again, deep in the sewer. Why? What is the importance of deep in the sewer? Well, I don't know the meaning, but what I think is, there will be a cruel muscle paradise that only the strongest can reach, brother! Ah, uh, it was a waste to ask. Now, let me join your family, brother! Let me travel with you from now on! You don't mind, right, brother? Former Evil King Big Bull became an ally. Okay. Uh, uh, you can't... say. <laughs> that just makes me think. You guys are taking me in, so... So I think I have something to give you. But what do I have to give it, brother? Ooh, yeah, you defeated me, brother. So the title of the status World King Evil Belt should go to you. Right on, brother. Reign over everything as the holder of the title belt. No, no, I don't want this. No one knows about this belt. What's the point? But the belt got... But the belt got broken in the fight. Damn it all. Well, when it's broken, it's broken. I should have something else. Ooh, how about this, brother? I've had this ever since I was enlightened through fighting. Yes, this is good. Take this, brother. And take good care of it. Manual handle. Uh, I see. Uh, thanks? You have a hard time. I agree. I love giving the stupid evil king trouble. Oh, you are our sister. Pleased to meet you, sister. Who is a sister? And I am the leader. I believe it is called Don in the lower world. You, Don, what did you say, Don? I am the brains of the fan. He's like the famous god. Oh, so you are the doc. You, and uh, him. Too complicated. <laughs> I'll actually use that one. Uh, what's that? You can't fool me, brother! Just as you know, what is he? Uh, basically, he's well, uh... Oh, okay! He's a cop! Yo, what up, dude? Hey, don't threaten him. Now let's go back. Not your sister! I'm not your sister! I'm really angry about that. <laughs> <laughs> adventurers becomes even stranger. What kinds of misadventures are in store for this peculiar party? So yeah, now I'll send it back to, the, to one of the inns and we can go and change the party members. Mm. <laughs> So now we're halfway through the game. Jesus. Brother! Brother? Evil King Sad, brother! That's it, we're gonna cut the part here. See you guys next time.